Um, I don't remember the name of the scene, but where I turn into all the different characters and I'm actually, yeah. That, oh, yeah. yeah. That is awesome. Chris, do you have a favorite that, scene? Oh, Greed's death. Greed's <laughs> <laughs> death for me, but you could lock and say and, oh, oh, no, I love, actually, I love the fight scene that, that we have. Wendy, Wendy, yes! Wendy, Wendy. <laughs> Whatever, the moment's over. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. I like that scene too. Because uh, I do a little flip. I love a flip. <laughs> I love when you make I the love flip. flip gesture. That's the thing. <laughs> uh, my, my favorite, most emotional scenes and favorite for me have always been um, in, the, in the original series any of the scenes between Ed and Ellie. Any of those emotional. Uh, Quiet, intimate moments between the two brothers were my favorite to play, um, without question. So. Apparently, we're supposed to call on this person next because there's been like 20 fingers pointing at them and for us to call them at last. So it's going to be the greatest okay. question in human in civilization, the world. yeah, ever. So big. I got a question. So it's already bad. The credit for Comrade Fragment video game. Did you get to meet the cast, or was it just stuck in recording? Say that one more time. Oh, okay. No, unfortunately, you know, a lot of times that's one of the bummers, you know, you don't get the chance to meet a lot of the people we work with. Yeah. We spend entire shows and don't meet the people that we act across with. And, and if they're not right there at the moment that we're in doing our thing, we often don't get that privilege. It's unfortunate. That's right. You know, we did, uh, we did um, D and Angel, and uh, Kevin Corn had been around for years. What? <laughs> you know, we have a dark and crowd here. Where are you guys? Hotness! We did, we did D and Angel, and Kevin Corn had been around for years working at, fun of, at uh, ADV. And I'd never met him. I don't know if you had either. And yeah. we did a we did a commentary, and Kevin and I spent the whole commentary just all jazzed about meeting each other for the first time because oh, we haven't met each other. So unfortunately, you miss out on opportunities in voice acting to meet people that you work with. I didn't meet you until the movie. Oh my God! I did not right. meet until the movie came out. We met each other at the movie theater. I was like, who's that guy in that shiny? Cross rock star shirt with the painted jeans, and they're like, Doofus, that is a lead in the show. <laughs> That's how I met him. And she came over and like grabbed my leg. <laughs> she is so funny. We had so much fun. I think we gotta wrap it up. Look, is there one more quick question that's a good one? Oh, everybody, you're waving so hard. Yes. With all the different voices that we do, how do you how do you pick how do you go into the studio and know what to bring? Right. I think uh, just knowing what archetype your different voices fall into, and then like just sort of when you see the character breakdowns, figuring out which characters are what archetypes, and that's kind of how we do. Yep. Yeah. Plus, you go in, and I think you just have to be unafraid to, to throw something down because then the director is the one who will say that's all wrong. <laughs> you know, or higher or lower. She's younger, can you do a lisp? You know, whatever. <laughs> that was a really good question. Thank you guys so much for coming.